Hi everyone, this is the gas walkthrough for October 14th. I'm Philip Newman. Today I'm solving Wristwatch by Bill Murphy. This is a little killer and consecutive pairs. We had consecutive pairs last time I saw a Bill puzzle. Um, but we have normal pseudo curls, one to nine inch row column, and three by three box. Consecutive pairs, digits connected by white dots must be consecutive, have a difference of one. And little killer, we have some clues outside the grid. They tell us the sum of the digits along the indicated diagonal. So these two digits sum to four, these three digits sum to 14, and so on. Those are the rules. And we're gonna start with our short ones because these are, are, are all forced. Um, I've been trouble talking tonight, apparently. Um, the only way to make four in two cells that see each other is one, three. The only, only way to make three is one, two. The only way to make 16 is seven, nine. And the only way to make 17 is eight, nine. So those are all forced. And we can do a little bit with our white dots immediately. So the digits that are consecutive with one and three are two and four. We don't know the order yet, but these are both on this 14 diagonal. So we need to make 14 in these cells. We already have six in these two cells. So this is an eight. And now going consecutive from eight, we can't go up because that would be nine, 10. So this has to be seven, six. Um, this has to be consecutive with one or two. But if this were one, we would need a two here and that's gonna break the two that you know we need on the three glue. So this must be two, three like this, and this is one. That makes this one and three. The one has to go next to two, so that's resolved. Now 19 and three cells, if we already have a three, that leaves 16, and we already know the only way to do that in two cells is seven, nine. Now all of these must be consecutive with six or eight. And we're gonna do the same sort of thing here. We have 18, we already have 14 from these two, so this is four. Now this could go up or down as far as this cell is concerned, um, but can't go up here because of the six. So we would have five, six. So this has to be three, two instead. And now this clue is similar to down here. Um, in order to be consecutive with eight or nine, we're gonna to have to put a seven here. This can't be nine for multiple reasons. Nine can only go next to eight, and we have an eight, nine pair, and eight is also already in this row. So this has to be seven, eight, and nine, like that. It's gonna resolve nine and seven. It's gonna resolve nine and seven. The nines have to be consecutive with eight, and so that puts a six here. And now the 11 clue, we already have seven, so we need four as our remainder, and the only way to do that is one, three. And we need a two next to the one here. So that is all of the little killer clues. It's not all of the consecutive clues yet, but we will get there. Um, let's start in this box, I guess. Uh, where does nine go? Can't go in these cells because of this nine. Can't go in this cell because of the nine in the top row. And now these are five, six, and seven, but we have a six, seven here. And that's gonna leave six and seven in this order because of this seven. These are four and nine. We already have a nine in the box. These are five, six, and eight. The six looks down to place six here, and then five and eight. All right, these are one, two, three, five. And one can't go in these cells or this cell because of these ones. So this is our one. These are two, three, and five. The only digits there that are consecutive are two, three. And they have to go in that order because of this two, three pair. Uh, we still need a one in this column and then a six to finish the column. These are gonna be seven and eight. We know the order from this eight. These are gonna be two and three. We know the order from this two. And now we can't go up from seven because of the eight here. So this has to be six, five. We can't go down from three because of the two here. So this has to be four, five. 
uh, 7 and 9 in this row because of that 7, and then 1 and 6 because of the 6. Let's finish this box. Uh, still need a 5. It's got to go here. 2 and 4 in that order. Now these are 1 and 3. They're resolved by the 3. These are 9 and 4 resolved by that 4. All right, looking down the column, we have 4, 5, 6. That one's not 6. Here we have 7, 8, 9. And the only way to make these consecutive is 6, 7, like that. All right, here we need 4, 5, and 8. And here we need 1, 2, 3. The only way to make that work is 3, 4. So those are consecutive. And the 2 looks over for 1 and 2. I don't think this is resolved, but we're going to have to go into the center. Need 2, 3, 4 in this column. We have 3 and 4 there. We have a 2 and 4 there. And we have a 2 and 3 there. These are 1, 5, and 9. 1 has to go here. The 9 and 5, because of that 5. That resolves 5 and 8. Resolves 9 and 8. And to finish off, we have 6, 7, 8. And that's the solution. Uh, nice symmetry there from Bill. And it, it just flows nicely. Um, making use of these very restricted two-digit sums and then the effect that they have on the rest of the puzzle. So I hope you enjoyed that. Let us know how you did in the comments, and I will see you in a few days.